Welcome to the product tutorials on how to assign and unassign licenses for any user in the Replicon system. I'm now logged in into the Replicon instance. In this video, I will talk about assigning and unassigning licenses to multiple users at once. Please note that you can follow the same set of steps in order to assign and unassign licenses for any specific user in the Replicon system. In order to assign or unassign licenses, go over to Administration and click on Users that's available under the Employees and Organizations section. On the User List page, go ahead and choose the list of people that you would like to assign or unassign the license for. Once you've chosen the list of people, click on the Edit button that's available on the top of the screen. On the Mass Edit page that you reach now, Click the Licenses section that you see on the left hand side. You will now see a list of licenses that are available or bought by your organization. To assign a license to all the users that you have chosen, go ahead and click on the On Radio button that you see here. To unassign the licenses from all the list of people that you have chosen, click on the Off Radio button that you see in this section here. In case you do not want to make any changes with regards to any other license assignment, please have the radio button called No Change selected for the others. Once you have chosen the ones to assign and the ones to unassign, click on the Save button and you will see a pop-up that will show you the change that you are about to make and the list of people who will be affected with this change. Click on the Save button to make this change effective for all the users that you have chosen. If you want to keep editing or make more changes to the user profile that you have chosen, click on the Keep Editing button or click on Continue to go back to the user list page. In case you are planning to assign or unassign license for any one user, then all that you need to do is just click on the username, move over to the Licenses section that's available on the left hand side and switch on the radio button to assign the license and switch off the radio button to unassign the license from the profile. This is how you can assign or unassign licenses for any specific user or a group of users in the Replicon system. As an administrator, you can keep the track of the assigned licenses or the license count through the Manage Account section. In order to access the Manage Account, go over to Administration and click on the Manage Account option available under the System and Security section. On the Manage Account page, you will see the list of licenses that you have purchased, the total number of purchased licenses, and the number of licenses out of the purchased licenses that you have assigned to users. In order to know who is assigned to this particular license, click on the License Assigned number and you will be taken to the User List page where you will be able to see all the users who have been assigned this particular license. If you go back to the page and click on the next number of assignment, you will now see the list of users assigned to the next license that you have chosen. This is how you can find out the total assigned users to each license that you have purchased. Thank you for watching the video. Did you know that you can now stay updated about the Replicon changes and talk to the product management team of Replicon directly using the Replicon community. In order to access our Replicon community, go over to the home page of Replicon, that's replicon.com and move over to the Customer Zone option that's available on the top right hand corner. On the Customer Zone page, click on Community that you see on the top as an option and on Community, you can go ahead and raise any questions or ideas that will reach our product management team directly and you would receive an answer directly from them. If you want to follow the updates that are done by Replicon every week, then click on the Categories section that you see on the top and now choose Product Updates as the section. Go ahead and follow this section and every Monday you would receive an email that would specify the updates that we have done in the previous week into Replicon.